Today, several people lined up at Naguru to get vaccinated at an event organized by Wachiga Nation, which brings together people from Chige's region. The organizer of the event says they have attracted people beyond the Bachiga Nation attendees to get the COVID-19 jab. We look at what their fans are doing. Uh, because usually during our festivals we have quite a number of people. So if we can get half of that number vaccinated or even more, because now we are not targeting just the Bachiga, but all the people, all the Ugandans, all the time. The process was uh, swift, I liked it. I thought initially that it would be a long queue. But what is very important, where I've chosen to be vaccinated, is I want kids to go back to school. Getting vaccinated is very, very important. Um, with the pandemic and the virus the way it is, so many variants, you can't take any chances. Emmanuel Inebiona, the spokesperson of the Ministry of Health, says they have so far received over 30.6 million doses of COVID-19 vaccines. We have received over 30.6 million doses of COVID-19 vaccines. We have so far distributed about 16 million doses of vaccines. So we expect each and every one to ensure that they get vaccinated. This means that they have in stock over 14 million doses that have not yet been distributed. In stock, they have all the six vaccines approved by the National Drug Authority. All the six brands, AstraZeneca, Pfizer, Moderna, Johnson & Johnson, Sinopharm and Sinovac. The ministry is now calling on people to get vaccinated before the economy can be fully opened. Evidence is indicating that people who are vaccinated are not affected as much as those ones who are not vaccinated in, in South Africa where Omicron was first detected. The ministry is in the final stages of presenting an amendment to the Public Health Act which will include mandatory vaccination against COVID-19. Jumakiria, NTV.